This video is brought to you by Smash Balloon. Hey there, and welcome to WP Beginner, where we teach all about WordPress so you can grow your website and reach your audience. And in this month's state of WP Beginner, we have a lot to cover, so let's dive right in. First with the announcements, WP Beginner turned 11 this year, which is a huge accomplishment for any website. And you can read all about the goings on over the last year from Syed Balki, who is the founder and CEO of WP Beginner, as well as all of the other plugins that come underneath that. You can read his, his reflections and updates on We'll have a link in the description below. You'll also want to go to that link because in celebration of turning 11, we're doing a huge giveaway. We're calling it the ultimate website toolkit. One lucky winner is going to get a MacBook Air, free domain and hosting from SiteGround. And they're also going to get an hour Zoom call with Syed, which is a big deal because if you're wanting to grow your website and build a business, he is the perfect person to talk to about it all. In addition to all that, you'll get pro licenses to all of the premium plugins that are under WP Beginners umbrella. So that's over, that's 16 plugins, including WP Forms, Optin Monster, Monster Insights, and our newest one, Smash Balloon. And then that leads us into the next announcement, which is that Smash Balloon has joined WP Beginner as one of the premium plugins to help you grow your social media channels by offering a whole suite of plugins, including plugin for YouTube, Instagram, Twitter, and Facebook. And I've been working with Smash Balloon this last few weeks in doing tutorials for you. And it is a lot of fun to integrate these social media profiles in with our WordPress website. Smash Balloon just makes it super easy to do that. You can head over to smashballoon.com and make sure you use promo code WPB VIP and you'll get the best deal on Smash Balloon. Now let's dive into some of the tutorials that will help you grow your website even further. First, we get asked this all the time in our Facebook group as well as YouTube and so many other places on how to edit WordPress homepage. You might have a theme that you love, but there might be some things that you want to change. So we put together a quick tutorial on how to edit your WordPress homepage effective and easily. So you want to check that out and then how to add horizontal line separators. A lot of times people want to just kind of break up the content on your site by doing some horizontal lines. We show you five different methods that you can do. And then if you're working on your website or you're practicing on how to learn WordPress and you got it down and you kind of want to just reset your website, but you don't want to reinstall and delete and all that stuff that goes with it. We put together a, an article and a video if you want to watch it on how to restart a WordPress site, reset WordPress the fast way. And I use this probably almost every week since I do demo sites, but you can use it after you've had a site that you want to just restart from scratch or if you've been playing in a sandbox type style and now you're ready to really get started and grow your website, check that out. Going along with a lot of the social media aspect, we also put together a couple of tutorials on one on how to add Facebook open graph metadata in WordPress themes. It sounds really complicated, but it's really easy. When you share your articles on your different social media platforms, they use the Facebook open graph metadata to bring in like your thumbnail and the title and description. So you want to get that right. And we show you how you can make sure that you do that right. And then for people who haven't quite done it right, we show you how you can fix the Facebook incorrect thumbnail issue that you can sometimes get with WordPress where the thumbnail doesn't come over into Facebook. So you can fix it and then use the other tutorial to make sure that you've fixed it for all of the future times. And then for any of you who are obsessed with doing a before and after on any project that you do or portfolio, we have put together on how to put images side by side in WordPress. I know that's a huge thing for contractors or designers or anybody who just wants to show what you did before or what you did after is a great tutorial on how to do that. If sending email is a big thing for your website, then we show you how to send email in WordPress using the Gmail SMTP server instead of WordPress's server. And that should increase the deliverability or making sure that your emails get sent out properly by doing that. And then also if social media is a big deal for you, we have gathered up the seven best Instagram plugins for WordPress that are easy to use. And as well as with themes, we put together 25 best one page themes for WordPress. If you are getting into e-commerce, getting paid is one of the most important things that you can do for that. So we put together six best WooCommerce payment gateways for WordPress. So you make sure that you're getting paid and then to create loyalty with your visitors, we show you how to create a loyalty program in WooCommerce. 
and how to add a free shipping bar for WooCommerce at the top of your site to really entice people to shop with you. If local delivery is a big part of your website, then we also walk you through how to set up delivery time spots in WooCommerce. Step by step, we'll go through that to show you how you can do that. And then how to create a secure contact form in WordPress. Super important for when people are submitting their information to you that it is secure and encrypted. And we show you how you can do that. Make sure you click on the link in the description below to head over and sign up for the giveaway that we're doing that ends this week. So if you're watching this when it just came out, you still have a little bit of time to enter. And then if you don't make it in time, make sure you head over and join our Facebook group where we're doing giveaways monthly or as we reach milestones over there. But more importantly, that is a great location to go and ask questions all about WordPress. And finally, we just want to thank everyone for being a part of the journey as we go through this. And we're hoping to make next year even better for you. And then as a PS, we are hiring for several positions throughout our company. So if you know someone or if you are someone, make sure you take a look at the PS in the article for the 11th year celebration to see all the details on how to apply. And thanks for watching.